We're here on Lower Greenville at Torelli's, one of the renowned places in Dallas. It, the restaurant has been here as long as I can remember. And we're here with Amanda, one of the family members who has owned this restaurant from the beginning. But I'd like to hear the history, Amanda. Okay, my mom actually opened it over 25 years ago. I came on her staff about officially 2003, but I was cashiering here back in the day when I was 13 years old, so I've kind of always been a part, but she opened it over 25 years ago. We just had our 28th anniversary, actually, um, this year. And um, you had a fire here not that long ago, didn't you? Yes, we did. We had a fire on March 2nd of 2010. Um, it took out the entire block that we sit on. There's three other restaurants, and so we had to rebuild, and we opened again of September 2012. The facility is marvelous now because I remember, and it wasn't like this, Amanda, you guys have really done an unbelievable job. Tell us about the facility now. It's so different than the original one. You know, the original one had low-lying ceilings. It was, it was very intimate, very small. Um, we tried to keep the same feel, but yet offer more for our guests. We've always wanted party facilities. We wanted a rooftop patio, so now we've got the main area, then we have a second level mezzanine, and then we have a third level rooftop, each equipped with a full bar. And the food has always been magnificent. Uh, and as I recall, you also had though fish, you had some chicken, uh, and some meats, so it wasn't completely Italian. You did have some other some other dishes. Tell us about the food. Yes, um, we've always kind of been called eclectic Italian, and so we do have wood grilled steaks and seafood. Uh, a lot of the recipes came from Asperia, Italy, which is where my mom, where our family's originally from. She's also taken a bunch of her own knowledge and her own background and created some great dishes. Um, you know, we still have your chicken parmesans and your meat lasagna, but then we also have. Um, a great steak, we have sea bass, trout, we've got a lot of beautiful dishes. And for the person that wants to enjoy a glass of wine with that, tell us about your wine options. Yes, we've got a great wine list, wine by the glass and by the bottle. Um, on Tuesdays we have half price wine, so that's a really great time to come in. But we do have a staff sommelier, he's been with us for about 15 years and he keeps it fresh and new and, and updated so that everybody can come in and experience the flavors of almost any region that you want to try. And with the facility size like it is now, you can do pro some private parties and corporate events, is yes. that correct? We can do business meetings, we've done rehearsal dinners, corporate events, um, I mean you name it, you can do it. We can accommodate up to 50 people, so it's a pretty good size group. Can you get the kitchen to, to, to prepare a couple of dishes for us? I'd, I'd love to show the audience what you can really do here. I've tasted it, I've experienced it, but when you put that on a video, people want to come eat here. Sure, I can get something together for you. Let's go back in the kitchen. All right. Amanda, what has the kitchen prepared? Oh my goodness. This is our trademark creation, the Italcio. It's our Italian nacho. It's basically our in-house made pizza crust that we fry to make a chip out of and you can put any topping you want, want on it and they are fantastic. You can only find them here. Delightful. You must have known I was coming today. Shrimp scampi. I mean, that is one of my favorites. This is actually one of my favorites too. We have our jumbo shrimp and we've sauteed them in a garlic white wine butter and then served them over our Italian rice with our pomodori tomato mix, which is our roasted tomatoes with balsamic, garlic, and olive oil on the side. And where did you get those shrimp? They're like jumbo. <laughs> we got them straight from the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you had an ocean in your backyard. We do. <laughs> <laughs> and we also serve it with a side of Tawaka butter that we make in-house as well. Oh my goodness. Look at this chocolate cake and, and what is that, gelato? That is, that is our chocolate seduction cake. It's a fudge frosting with a creamy rich fudge, fudge filling and then it comes with our vanilla gelato on the side. I think the next time I come, I'm just going to order the dessert. <laughs> it is delicious. It's our most popular dessert that we have. This is David Gold for FirstClassDallas.com. We were on Lower Greenville. We were at Torelli's, a place that you just have to go. It's a place to be seen in Dallas. It's a place with great ambiance, and the food is really terrific. It's genuine. It's fresh. It's made daily. It's got the Italian accent to it. You can't find anything in Dallas quite like this. Amanda, it's been a pleasure being with you today. I appreciate the time that you spent with us and allowed us to come into your very fine establishment. And we wish you the best. 
You're adorable and a delight to work with. Thank you very much and have a great day.